We now need to add the maize for Cheese Chase. The maize is going to be a sprite, not a backdrop. So we are going to create the maze. So you're going to click on the choose the sprite and click on the paint brush so we get paint the maze. Now we're going to click on convert to bitmap and then you're going to pick a dark color for the maze walls. So maybe I'm going to make a darker purple. Okay. Now you're going to draw the maze in the empty space right here. Start by adding the outside of the maze at the outer edge of the checkered pass. If you hold the shift key down while, while dragging your line down, it will let you draw a perfectly straight line. If you would like your lines to be fatter, you can raise the number of pixels right in that little box. And if I hold the shift key down, my line is perfectly straight-ish. So I can now draw the borders. Around my maze. So I have the outline of my maze. Now you want to draw your lines inside the maze, but remember, you got to make it possible to get through. So you don't want to have everything closed up, and you can make any pattern that you want. So I'm just going to make some patterns. of my maze. And remember, when I want to end a line, I just click and that ends the line. Not the best, you can do better. Now, we want to make sure that this maze is always in the middle. So when I'm on the sprite, we're going to go to code and we're just going to add a little code for when your flag is clicked, we always want to make sure that this maze goes right to the center. So right at the center are the coordinates of X0 and Y0. Now, when we run, you can see the mouse can go through the walls. Well, don't worry, we're going to change that. 